Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Joe from Fandroid. We're back. It's the end of another week, and we've got five more games to play, so let's get started. Timber West is an arcade uh, style shooting game. Um, so you're this little uh, cowboy here in the bottom and all you're gonna do as you can see is you press and hold to release which is gonna shoot the guy. So basically you hold for when you want the target to stop and where you have your f uh, finger on the bottom of the screen is how you aim. And then on the top of the screen there's this bar and that's basically how much time you have to shoot these guys. Oh, I just missed there. There we go. So if that bar runs out, uh, the guy's gonna shoot you. So now we're moving to the next stage here. You can slide your finger um, like back and forth to adjust your aim, but it's kind of just easier to get the right spot on the bottom of the screen. Oh crap, there we go, there we go, there we go. There's these little like money things that run around every once in a while that you can get, um, but it's hard. Oh, there we go. Oh, ran out of time, that guy got me. So you can see the basic premise of the game is to see how long you can survive shooting all these guys. This is called Timber West. Rolly Vortex is probably similar to a game you've played called Super Hexagon. Uh, but this game is free and it's a ball rolling through a tube. So all you gotta do is just avoid these obstacles. Uh, but every once in a while there's gonna be other things to avoid. Uh, let's try it one more time and see how far I can get. Here we go. Getting through there. Whoop. All right, that time I got it and it didn't, oh crap. Um, so that's, you know, basic idea. You've played a game like this before. It's fun, it's addictive. It's called Rolly Vortex. I've gotta warn you before this game, it's super addictive. I played it way too long just getting a feel for it before this video. This is called 2048 Bricks. You probably remember 2048, it was a super popular game a couple years ago where you just combine numbers. And this game is basically the same idea, but it's like Tetris. So you move around and you drop the numbers like so, and when you get the numbers on top of each other or next to each other, they combine like that. And that's the main thing that you're doing here because uh, if the numbers get to the top of the screen, just like regular Tetris, the game is over. So you wanna combine them as far as you can. And see there, they got uh, three of them combined there, so that was pretty cool. Now I'm up to 128. Let's get this 32 over there. And this game, you know, if you're really good at this game, you can sit here playing one level or one uh, round for a very long time. And that's what makes it addictive because you kind of just lose track of time while you're playing this, uh, like 2048. Um, but the Tetris element makes this really fun. Uh, you get the idea, just play as long as you can. You got your high score going up at the top there. Um, let's see if I can score. My high score is 18,248. See if you guys can beat that. Undersea is an endless runner type game where you control this little creature and all you do is you move your finger back and forth in the screen to steer. You're gonna collect those things and you get through the openings that are like the slightly brighter shade of color and you like break through. Avoid those. Uh, sometimes the holes are like smaller so it's harder to get through. And as you can see, when I collect the things, they add to the body so I get longer the more that I collect. So here we go. We're Get a 63 point, avoid that guy. We got some current to go against there. So you just wanna see how long you can go. Uh, I'm in world 113 right now. Oh crap, just hit that guy. Uh, so I collected six that time. I got to world 114, my score was 104, not bad. This is called Undersea. Box Boss is a game all about boxes, as you might guess. So we'll get into a level here. Um, this is level one, and you can see there's a number on the side that's 10, and I need to collect 10 items to get past this level. So there's the, uh, the box that I control, and I'm on top of other boxes, and here's the boxes that I need to collect. So there I got one, now the thing's down to nine, and there's other cubes that are on the screen right now, and they are what I have to avoid. So they're kind of just like constantly moving across the screen. Sometimes they're gonna be in the way of what I need to collect, but all I need to do is collect 10 of these things, and then I will be on to the next level. 
kind of want to stay away from the edges because when the uh, pink boxes appear, uh, you're going to kind of be trapped. So make sure you're being aware of that. You got one more to go. Boom, pass that one on to the next. Now as the game progresses, uh, you're gonna get more challenges. So now, we've got ones coming from the bottom. There's gonna be ones coming from the top as well. Uh, there's also gonna be ones coming in other directions as the game goes on. But right now, I just need to collect these 10 boxes. And there we go, on to level three. At any time you want like more help, you can open up this bottom area and you can use real money or watch ads to unlock things. So that's the basic idea of Box Boss. It's a pretty fun game. That's gonna wrap up the games for this week. Hopefully you guys found some of these fun. If you did, be sure to give a thumbs up on this video. We always appreciate it. Check out our playlist with more apps and games and subscribe to the Fandroid channel for more videos. We'll see you next time.